As the final events of Bible prophecies are rapidly being fulfilled, the call coming from God to His people as such a crisis as this come up higher as Elijah called the people of God to come up on Mount Carmel. Come up higher because we have a high calling in Jesus Christ. Our High Calling, a devotional by Ellen G. White. Fruit Bearing Branches I am the true vine, and my Father is the husbandman. Every branch in me that beareth not fruit, he taketh away. And every branch that beareth fruit, he purgeth it, that it may bring forth more fruit. John 15 verses 1 and 2 The Savior points out the sign of discipleship. Herein is my Father glorified, that ye bear much fruit, so shall ye be my disciples. By faith we are to lay hold on a living God, and maintain an experience that shall breathe love, tenderness, kindness, compassion, and affection. These traits of character are the fruit that the Lord Jesus desires us to produce and to present before the world as a witness that we have a Savior who can uplift and who can satisfy. We need not be on the losing side, for in everything He is our sufficiency. What we need is the presence of Jesus Christ. We want His truth shining in our hearts, pervading all our life actions. This will determine whether or not we are branches of the true vine. If we are fruit-bearing branches, we may expect that the great husbandman will prune us, that we may bring forth more fruit. All that is useless, all that would hinder our growth in the Christian life, must be removed. When the purging comes, we frequently feel that the Lord is against us. Instead of this, we should look to ourselves and see if there is not something we have left undone or something we need to take away from our lives before we can stand in right relation to God. We must be living branches of the true vine, daily laying hold of our Redeemer, that we may bear the fruits of a Christian character. When we are willing to practice self-denial and self-sacrifice as Christ practiced it in His life, we shall bear fruit to God's glory. It is the Savior's delight to see His followers co laborers with God, receiving bountifully all the means of fruit-bearing and giving bountifully as workers under Him. Christ glorified His Father by the fruit He bore, and the lives of His true followers will produce the same result. Receiving and imparting, His works will produce much fruit.